Yeah, it's a full pile of deck up there. What's up, YouTube? So, let's get to the job site here, man. So, it's flushing that code. 8646 VFD communication error. So, this is a 25 VNA4. I got five units here. I got two units. So, it's telling me it, my PCM can't communicate with my VFD. So, you can see I do have my power, right? So, power's coming in. So, I know I'm going through my filter board to here. So I know I do have power. This right here, this this one here is community. This uh, harness comes up and plugs into here, and uh, that's the PCM. That's how it communicates with the VFD. So if you read your paperwork, it's telling you either I got a problem if my harness is good, then either I got a problem with PCM or my VFD, but. I got lights, I got everything here, so I'm gonna swap out the VFD and go from there. Alright, you two. So there's the old inverter. <coughs> I'm gonna show you. You can't really mess this up when putting it back together, but I'm gonna show you. You see, it comes with all that. So, it's for your reactor. You got two different terminals, so you can't mess them up you know what I mean so you know the black one here your white one's gonna go here so that's the one which I can't see it so there we go that's there so it's I know it's gonna be hard to see but it tells you yellow red black so you can't mess you can't mess these up you know yellow red black you can't mess none of that up. This goes into here. So, you know, like I said, none of this you can really mess up. <laughs> so you should be good to go there. We're gonna put this one back to here. And you know, I'm gonna plug these to your condenser fan motor in. And uh, you got this. That's really it. We'll take another look on there because this is where you would test um you know your output of the vfd plus and your negative so it's pretty straightforward so give me a minute here let me plug this in and we'll get the power back on and see how we did that's uh so i'm just waiting for it now i just put it in the checkout mode but you can see i got my lights on now Let's see. We really don't have any codes flashing. We got to communicate. Oh, it's just coming on now. So I'll probe up here now. It's in oh, Florida, so I don't know. It might be 70 degrees out right now. I don't know. My fan's going. So good sign. Good sign. I trim back my low voltage. They had it looped up, and I don't know. But that's how I diagnosed that. I mean, I had my lights, everything on the PCM seemed to be working. I did have my high voltage coming up. It's going through the filter board into here, so I knew I had power to there. I don't know. I'm gonna have another video. I got another unit that uh, we're going to fire it up. This this wasn't plugged into the VFD, so it was throwing the code, not communicating. And we opened it up and I'm like, what the hell? I found this wire was <laughs> was buried down in here. But uh, it's thrown another code. And we found the freaking sensor was missing. So I got to mess with that one. All right, guys.